Hi guys and welcome to a very, 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 very squad builder thingy with myself, Bates and 87. As you can see, there's a turquoise card, an aqua card, a 95 rated player card. This is the most rarest player on the game to date so far. And I've been able to get my hands on him to produce this content and show you on YouTube that these cards do exist. But if you look at this card, 95 rated Rodriguez. Originally, he is a 69 rated non-rare silver card and he plays for Southampton and he is English. But he is the best English player on the whole of the game, bar obviously Luke Shaw's player card, which is also rated 95. As you can see, he's there with the work rates a week for and the skill moves. This is the first owner as well. The account I have actually got it on is uh, actually Jay's brother. His link to his Twitter is down below. You can go and check him out on Twitter and also his Tom, uh, his friend Tom, who did get in touch with me uh, to be able to borrow it. As you can see, he's played a lot of games with him, but as you can see here. The guy, if you go to quick sell him, is worth zero coins. He is also an untradeable item. So I was lent the account uh, just to do it. But I've sent some special friends over to build a squad of him, play some games, get some goals, and bring this content to you. So guys, if you can smash over 5,000 likes on this video, that would be absolutely insane. Share it with your friends. Show the world that these cards do exist. And uh, also, if you want any element team coins, go and check out fifacoinstash.com. Their links can be found down below as well. So let's get on build this team have some fun and uh yeah just show off this 95 rated blue card so let's build the team around him first in the center midfield position we have got lalana he gets a, a perfect link with him being from southampton and english also at the left back position we have gone with also luke shaw the uh unfortunately we don't have his player card we have his normal card which is worth a bit of coin anyway but the team looks distinctly average because of that blue card. So let's make this team a lot better. In the striker position, we are going to put Romario, uh, the second best Brazilian striker on the game. Because I haven't seen a Pele on the market of you. Moving on to the right forward, we have Luis Figo, the uh, Portuguese right forward. And the two centre mids to pair with him, we have Vieira on the, in the middle. And on the right-hand side, we have Rude Hullett, who is a 90... 90 rated card also in the two center back positions we have maldini we also have cannavaro uh, two of the highest rated defenders on the game and then to lower the rating down a little bit we have got gary neville the ex-manchester united legend moving on to the goalkeeper to finish off this awesome team it is van der Sar. he uh, played for manchester united ajax and fulham so there we have it guys that is an absolutely incredible team uh, what i'm going to do now is show you the highlights of the games that they get with this team and uh hopefully talk a little bit more about that blue card and uh, hopefully it does as good as I expect it to do. So thanks very much for watching this. Try and smash over 5,000 likes. Subscribe, like and I'll be back in a sec with the highlights from the games. So we're back guys and these are the highlights we did get with uh, the player card Rodriguez. Very special thanks to the guys who let me use the player and also uh, take advantage of such awesomeness in the card as well. The player was absolutely insane to use. The only lack I did notice was his uh, two star skill moves. But guys if you lot want to see me do a player review on this card make sure you let me know in the comment section below. If we get so let's say 8,000 likes for this video and I will do a player review on him so you lot can see his in game stats and everything else like that if you want um so yeah the team was solid uh, not only was jay really good but there was also the likes of romario uh, figo Vieira, hullet and hullet scored some amazing goals as well uh, as you will see coming up with the defense uh, with cannavaro and maldini i don't really know they were very fucking um they were very what do you call it like very rushy they seem to run up all the time and were too eager to get involved in the play but look at this from a goal from rude hullet from that far out absolutely ridiculous and it is definitely worth a replay with david seaman though i was very surprised to see how good he was uh, and also with the left back luke shaw unfortunately i was unable to get hold of his player card there's only a limited few people who can um but that luke shaw normal card the silver one is just uh, as good as any of the gold left backs that I have used in the BPL. If you guys haven't used Luke Shaw, make sure you do. Definitely worth the try. And I haven't even used Jay Rodriguez's normal card. Uh, that's something I'm definitely going to have to try in the future now, especially after being able to try his uh, 95 version out ahead of a lot of other people. Um, so, yeah, on 
on Saturday, we've got another squad builder coming out with him, obviously, uh, with the best possible England team. And obviously, be, him being 95 rated is the best England player on the game by a country fucking mile. I think the next best player is maybe... I think it's actually Gary Lineker and he's 89 rated. Uh, so guys, this has been my uh, experience with the first 95 player card to surface on Ultimate Team this year. Uh, they are untradeable items, they are discarding at zero coins, so we'll never see them on the transfer market, uh, which is good for some people, but bad for others. Uh, it shows how rare they actually are. But this card isn't as rare as Pele, so I need to point that out. So guys, if you want any Ultimate Team coins, go and check out FIFACoinsStash.com. Their link can be found down below. Drop a like on the video, share it with your friends, have fun, and let me know in the comment section below about what you thought about the team. So thanks for watching, subscribe for more awesome FIFA 14 next-gen content, and have a very nice day.